Hi Virgos, welcome back to I Enigma. This is Enigma. Let's do your mid messages, mid October messages. What are the messages for you, Virgos? Sun, Moon, Rising, or Venus signs plus cross watches. Let us see. All right, so. Oh, wow. Okay. All right. All right, Vogos. So I feel like someone's mind towards you is changing. Okay. And they regret losing you okay this person regrets losing you and there was an energy of an older female that could have been married coming between you and your person and i feel like um, whoever you were dealing with uh what was this person is missing you they feel like they could change the past okay this person is someone from the past i was thinking non-stop about you and this was a karmic no doubt but this connection could have moved towards marriage because this person is not a bad person though but there was an influence of an older female that knew both of you that came between you and this person maybe you guys were about to get married and this older female came into uh, this relationship and destroyed it okay and this person has found the truth and they feel like they need to reconcile but you are coming off as mystery. They don't know what you want right now. They keep thinking about you. This person has been wanting to reconnect with you. They've been watching you very closely and they feel like there's some connection. They need to figure out what that connection is. Because you were something. Like when you came into their life, you brought a lot of positivity and a lot of changes in um, this person's life. But there was a female, maybe it is their mom, that came in between you guys okay and this person misses you like crazy now that they are thinking about marriage they feel like they could have not ever left you or you were the best person in their life they should have chosen you okay but this person right now is very confused like should they reach out to you and get things um you know back on track or start a new beginning because i feel like this person wants a new beginning with you but they are not sure what you want right now whether you want to be with this person or not so there is this fear here confusion here they also feel like now you would never reach out to them or you would never accept this person because um you're going to stick to your decision for your sake for the sake of your self-respect and this is giving them sleepless nights maybe they're going through the bad karmic cycle right now and now in this phase they're realizing who's honest who's not and this person wants to leave everybody and be with you but they think that you've changed and you don't no longer care about this person they think about you non-stop and i'm seeing that this person with the ace of swords i'm strongly sensing they want to reach out to you they want a communication they want a new beginning with you they want marriage if you'd allow this person but they're confused they still don't have a proper clarity who is right, who is not right. I feel somewhere a part of them still believes in the other person that maybe they are taking it too overboard. They should just forget you and move on. But then there is a link, there is a telepathic bond that they're not able to cut. They're not able to, you know, uh, break. They want to break that bond. But the connection is strong. And they're trying to figure out why and how is this connection so strong. Let me see what sign this person could be. Sun, Moon, Rising or Venus. They have been thinking about you non-stop. This could be an Aquarius. Alright. This could be a Libra. This could be a Pisces. These are the most probable signs here. Now the signs could be any. Okay. It doesn't mean that if I didn't take certain other signs, that doesn't mean it's not your read. Could be a Scorpio as well. But they're not liking the ending that has happened. The ending was abrupt and they didn't give this relationship a chance, okay? Or they didn't give you a benefit of doubt. They just ended it or you ended it because their drama was going overboard and you couldn't take it. And they're feeling really bad about it. 
they feel they want a new beginning but they think that you moved on and you do not care about this person you no longer are interested in them that's how they see you they feel so bad okay and i feel this person is going through something which is not very positive okay maybe this the same person that came in between you guys is draining them and they want your energy to feel good about themselves and that is why they miss you use crystals to help you understand what's going on with this person or if you want to attract the right person if you want to attract this person towards you i feel the crystals will really help somewhere they remember you through crystals did you discuss about that did you offer them a crystal did you like gift them a crystal or that's another sign that they want a crystal from you okay or you're going to gift them but i feel like yes something to do with like if you just speak to your crystal that may this person may whoever is interested in me come towards me or you know whatever you can just give your affirmation to your crystal whatever you're wearing okay say for example i'm wearing this one which is a clear quartz and wood similarly if you're wearing an amethyst or any 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 other crystal just wear it overnight put an intention a one liner intention like may this person call me or message me if you're thinking about them then go to sleep that's it feeling alone this person is definitely left out nobody is there for them they're feeling very lonely okay hurt there's no one to take care of them they just miss your energy because you made them feel special you made them feel amazing okay they really felt good deep in your heart you already know the answer do what makes you feel right so i'm seeing that you will finally take a decision that is good for you and not for this person now you're going to read you know now you're going to listen to your heart and take a decision based on that instead of what the other person wants you're not going to you know um you're not going to open up your heart to someone that is unavailable or you won't do things for other people if you're not feeling happy doing that okay you're definitely open to new options i'm not seeing you taking this person back because this person is a big disappointment i'm seeing you opening up to new options but trust me everybody adores you you may not have found the right person yet virgos but whoever you have dealt with spoken to they all adore you especially this particular person they have been thinking non stop about you let me have more clarity about this person who is this person that is into you they are coming towards you they made a decision they want to meet you so basically they are going to call you message you ask you to meet they want to tell you something important you are special trust me this person sees you as a special someone but they are afraid of how you are going to respond to them because somewhere i feel they know that you are going to cut them off without any explanation and this person may get really hurt okay because they know that that at one point of time they hurt you and now you will get a chance to hurt them back that's how they're thinking so they're wondering how can they uh put an effort in impressing you in a way that you come and meet them they're also afraid of your words okay maybe you're too straightforward they don't know how you are going to say to uh reciprocate to this person's gesture towards you maybe it's a it's a connection that uh happened 8 months back okay or more i'm seeing they're missing you and they want to reach out to you for a new beginning again there's a ace of cups there is a ace of swords how do you feel about this person you have emotions for them it's not like you do not but you feel like they never respected you the way you respected them you still find them amazing you still want their love but you have given up you have no hopes left and you feel like there's no point of waiting on someone that didn't care about you if they hurt you once then game over this is your energy how does this person feel for you for you it is game over for this person it is um the game that begins now okay the game begins now this person will come towards you and this time if they come towards you there will be marriage because now they're thinking about something long term here they want to propose you they want to come towards you with a new beginning they want to settle down with you okay and this person is also someone that is going to avoid all the third party especially this person will come again and put all the nonsense in this person's head they will try their best 
and this person is going to shoo that person away they will not listen to that other person they will listen to you they want to spend the rest of their life with you the ten of pentacles they see you as the one they see you as their marriage partner and they're not going to share their um happiness with anyone else but you you mean a lot to this person trust me whoever this is passion and purpose the reason why this person got attracted to you so badly is because you never you never dive you know you never got uh, drifted away from your dreams your ambitions your goals and this is something that surprises this person when they left you kept on growing you kept on rising you built you know your position and you kept growing and this person knows this thing and they know that you're a person that follows your heart and you believe in yourself so that makes them feel like you're something different you're something special and they're coming with a new start and you will be surprised that this person has changed so much spiritually powerfully trust me a lot of money a lot of growth with your focus and dedication is coming in a lot of prosperity happiness good luck is coming in you believe in yourself and trust me there is new romantic cycle with this same person coming in so don't worry within the next few weeks you're going to listen what this person has to say to you now let me see in how many weeks this person is reaching out to you six weeks two weeks two to six weeks this person is right now contemplating they're wondering how they can reach out to you they're preparing themselves but i definitely see that now they feel a different connection towards you unlike before because they cannot stay away from you whoever this is they are into you completely i'm also sensing sleepless nights your wish will be granted maybe this is what you at one point of time really uh sincerely manifested even though the manifestation taken time but it's working now i'm not saying you go back to this person but you have the power of manifesting things now the air is clear the cloud is uh removed and this person knows you in and out okay they are coming towards you you don't have to you know panic and don't call out okay or don't get angry or frustrated with this person take the situation with a gentle approach listen to this person calmly and even if you want to reject them you can reject them calmly okay i feel somewhere around new moon if not full moon okay it's time to leave the past behind i'm seeing you rejecting this person calmly because now you have figured out love is really deep and this person is not the one that that is capable of your love because your love is deeper than uh an average person's iq okay of understanding what love is so i'm seeing you are you've been hurt in the past and you're going to forgive them and move on but it will really help you heal yourself deeply and get along with your journey towards more success more beautiful opportunities and new love a lot of love is coming for some of you can forget the past and give this person a new uh beginning okay that depends but i'm seeing this person is coming with a complete new shift a complete new person they will be you'll be surprised that they're not the same person at all you never spoke about your honesty you kept mum and this person found out that you were the honest one or you were the right person and uh, they found it that you were the one that was like a hidden gem that never tried to brag about themselves this is your true uh success this is why you are more successful use your mind wisely yes i'm seeing you are also taking good care of your money save more is what i see and i think you are wise So if you feel like oh my time got wasted dating this person or just generally nothing is wasted each and every moment that you're embracing is a learn a learning is a lesson for you so it will only help you grow some of you 47 63 watching this some of you are in 30s watching this or 20s any but yeah you're working on balancing your emotions you're working on balancing your life because I can see you moving on. I can see you working with crystals. I can see you wearing crystals, especially amethyst. It will really keep you calm and relaxed. And amethyst is a necessary stone for you right now, Virgos. If you want it from me, you can get it from me. But an amethyst is going to help you a lot, balance your um, overall personality. Yeah, I'm seeing you being more confident and more creative. Let's see what else. 
I'm not seeing you wasting your time on people that you don't feel any kind of productivity from. Okay, this could be a Libra coming towards you. This person could be younger. They know that they did you wrong or they were not right or they left you in the middle of nowhere or they left you confused. This is what is making them worried. I'm also seeing you will be in, in, in a confusion that should I give this person a chance or is this my soulmate or not? There will be confusion around that. But you're not going to lower your standards is something that I'm seeing. You will be like a king or a queen. Someone's from Queensland, Italy, France, Finland, Quebec, okay, Algeria, Eiffel Tower. I see Eiffel Tower. You're going to stand tall, believe in yourself, keep your standards high. You love listening to music. I'm not seeing you lowering your standards. If this person is coming with true honesty, then I'm seeing you you know giving them a chance but i see there's very little chance for you to forgive them and move on uh, no for for you to forgive them and be with them because i'm seeing you moving on more but yes this person has to change themselves completely to be with you uh i feel you've already left this person but they are not able to believe this so they are in this uh, limbo right now cannot process their emotions or mental uh thoughts like their mind is running with your thoughts non-stop okay and this person wants peace so they will try to patch up with you yeah i'm seeing they were wearing a mask but now you will see the mask getting off and they're telling you that how much they love and respect you your love and respect for self is coming back i'm seeing you starting to believe yourself more okay so i can see that there is a lot more happiness like your inner child is healing you're feeling like you got the karma you know uh, like the karma has evened out from both the sides and now you feel like there is a light-hearted energy and you can move on with peace because i'm seeing overall whatever is happening will bring you more peace and you will end up with your soulmate whether it is this person or new person but you will end up with your soulmate that's for sure Let's see from Aries to Pisces, your person's feelings for you. Okay, the Aries person towards you, Virgo, is right now you guys are in no contact. They have little interest, but I'm seeing they're also talking to other people. The Taurus is right now having a huge crush on you. Okay, but this person is waiting for the right time. They also want to know how you feel. And then the Gemini is leaving you behind because they don't see themselves good enough for you. The Cancer person is in love. The Leo. They want a new... I feel like you're like a, a breath of fresh air. Uh, and the Leo wants to start a new chapter with you. Like a world for this person. Virgo is uh, restraining themselves from living the life of their dreams with you. Libra okay the Libra person right now is fooling you they're very receptive be careful Scorpio Scorpio towards you they have a lot of passion and love and respect for you Sagittarius two of swords the six of pentacles and the knight of pentacles this person is confused about your thoughts I feel like they're also trying to figure out their true emotions towards you they're not sure because until and unless they don't communicate with you, they don't feel the thing. But they are definitely thinking about you non-stop. They want to communicate first. Capricorn. They are trying to win your heart by hook or by crook. Aquarius. They want to settle down with you. This person is rich as heck. I feel they want to give you the... Um, what is that called? Stability. Okay. They want to make you... Uh, make your life uh, more stable more they, they're protective they're caring they want to be provider okay then i'm seeing the last which is the pisces towards okay virgo this person has been thinking about marriage very clearly they want marriage right off the bat okay so that's your reading i hope you've enjoyed this wonderful read and before we end this i want to take one more card which is 
peacemaker, peacekeeper, peacekeeper. Yes, you really want something that brings you peace. You're looking for peace. You're you're you crave peace, so you're desperate for it. So I'm seeing peace is coming for you. See your seeds grow. Be patient. I'm seeing a lot of success is coming in in short time. So take one step at a time. Okay, I'm seeing a lot of growth is coming in the near future. All right, in the springtime. In the next spring, okay, I'm seeing a lot of growth is coming, a lot of success over whatever you're doing right now. Be at peace. Only be with people or situations that don't confuse you or uh, drain your energy. So that's about it. I hope you've enjoyed this wonderful read. Do like, share, comment and subscribe.